Hello everyone, and welcome back with another Filmora tutorial. I'm going to show you how to get some of the free holiday effects added to Filmora that you can use them in your video. If you head over to filmstock.wondershare.com, you'll actually notice they have a lot of effects on there, including the new and trending ones that are really, really cool. In order to sort these out by the free ones, what I typically do is just go to free and then effects. And here are the latest free ones that you can actually use for a Filmora. Now let's say that you really wanted to have a couple Christmas ones. If you type in Christmas in the search bar under film stock, you'll see they have all the different effects and transitions that you can use. Let's say you want the free ones. You click the free and there you have it. You've got a Christmas greeting card that you could use for your intros or exits. You've also got the green screen effects, etc. In order to use these, you just click on it, hit download, and from there, it'll connect and start downloading the film stock library right here. Once you're done downloading what you want as far as elements and effects, you simply navigate back to Filmora. Add the video that you'd like to have and simply go under effects or elements. Everything that you've downloaded will simply be under downloads or you can scroll down and go to film stock and choose what you would actually want it. Filmora also has a wide variety of effects and elements under the hot and new tabs. You simply click it and it'll show you everything they have to offer for that specific genre. If you're looking for the premium standard or free, simply click the buttons on the top right and you can navigate to those as well. Today, we're gonna add some snow on this video that I have right here. So I'm gonna go down to film stock, Christmas green screen. I'm gonna double click the snow to make sure this is the one I want. And you simply drag and drop. Now in the video, I'm gonna actually mute this. If I hit play, you'll see that the effect Thanks. has been added and be comfortable doing it. It's quick and easy to do it. As you can see, the effect has been added on simply by just dragging it on top of the video that I'm actually working on. As far as the effects go, you cannot make them longer, but you certainly can make them shorter. So if you want to add multiple effects, just keep adding on to the timeline. It's as easy as that. Let's say that you want to adjust the actual effect. You double click the effect. You go to compositing. You can actually change the opacity of what you're trying to work on. As you'll see, I brightened it up a bit and decreased the opacity so it's not as strong. And the next one, I did not do that. You can see that it's a bit stronger. That is for the comparison. You can also rotate, flip, and scale the size of the effect or element that you've added to your video. You can use the rotate if I want to flip it all the way down and have it going upwards. I think that gives more of like a very, very sci-fi effect. You can flip it, you can scale it, or even make it smaller to have just a little part of it on the video. You can easily click it and drag it around. Now with these elements and effects, there's a lot of different things you could do with them. Yes, they're there for you to play with and have fun with, but at the same time, Filmora 10 gives you that ability to actually change and modify some of these effects. Other than that, I want to thank you all for being here. This was a very short tutorial on how to actually download and use and modify the Filmora effects and elements. If you want to see more, make sure you subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell because I'll be putting out at least two of these videos per month. Other than that, make sure you have an awesome holiday. Stay hydrated, stay cool or warm. Sign word out.